Hello! Welcome to the channel. So today, it's a fugly fucking morning and it's rainy and gross. But I would like to make a video for you today because I got a new wildfire case in the mail. And I bet some of y'all know what it is because y'all were tagging me in it. But anyways, it came in so I thought this morning I would go get a nice little coffee, have a nice little drive, and we would stop and unbox my new wildflower case. So you're getting like a little vloggy moment. Oh, someone's texting me. So we're gonna get like a little vlog moment. We're gonna go get a coffee from Starbucks in the drive-thru. And then we're just gonna hang out and open my new case because I know you guys wanna see it. I know I wanna see it, so let's fucking go, okay? Um, actually, before I start driving, I have to tape this down to the dash. Um, you wanna know my little hack for vlogging and driving? This double-sided tape from Home Depot. Shit sucks! I just stick it on the bottom of my camera and then smack it to the dash and you're fucking good to go. So see you in a sec. And we're back. Okay, let's fucking go. Since we're doing like a whole little vlog moment and a little Starbucks thing this morning, I thought maybe I would try something fresh and fun. But um, then yesterday I went to Starbucks and I was like, oh, I would like to try nitro cold brew because I've never had one of those. And so I was reading in the app, I'm like, let me get a nitro cold brew. And they're like, um, we don't fucking have that. And I was like, you're kidding, you're kidding me. I don't really know how to get out of here. Wish me luck. Oh, by the way, I'm not in my town, if you couldn't fucking tell. We don't have Starbucks in our town, because I live in a fucking village. Love my village, but like, coffee's limited. So anytime I'm in the city or like out of my town and there's somewhere else to get coffee, I get at least 12 to make up for lost time, you know what I'm saying? One thing I don't like about vlogging and driving is that I can't listen to music because I'll get copyrighted, and I really like listening to loud music. Right now, really into WAP by Cardi and Meg The Stallion. I don't know why, it's just very good to me. The video was incredible. The song is a bob and it just kind of kills me because it's so dirty and I don't know, I just, I just kind of love it. I feel like I've not filmed a car video in a really long time so like, mm, if this is terrible, let me know. I'm gonna adjust how you guys are sitting because much better. You're welcome! Thank God there was a bus that was beside me and I made eye contact with someone and I'm pretty sure they saw me and then they saw me in my camera and now I feel uncomfortable. This is why I can't vlog in public. Um, aside from the comfort of my own car, I can't fucking do it. But anyways, we're fucking here. We're gonna get a coffee. What are we gonna get? Um, let me know your recommendations. Ah, oh, that kind of sounds terrible, actually. Next. Well, that one doesn't sound too bad. Uh, maybe I'll get that. Um. That I'm definitely not getting, so don't ever tell me that again, I swear to fucking God. If you ever suggest that to me again, um, I'll block you. Oh, you must be kidding. You just must be kidding. I'm cutting you off, I don't even care, bye. <laughs> I just cut off a car so I could get in line. <laughs> um, let me look, actually, I'm not fucking looking at the app again, because last time I did that, it fucking failed me. So we're not, we're not about to do that again. No, we're not, no, we're not. Yeah, what did I, oh yeah, I wanted some kind of nitro cold brew, and then also had cold foam on it, but the guy was like, sir? We don't fucking have that. And I was like, oh, well, thanks for um, giving me absolutely nothing, sir. Why Why don't you have it? It's on your menu. The fuck? I do need a coffee drink, though, but I also kind of want something fresh and refreshing. But now I definitely need a coffee. I'm fucking tired. See, where I am right now is an hour ahead of my actual town. So, like, right now in my town, it's 10 o'clock. But here, it's 11 o'clock. But I just go by my own time because I live my life every day and so I'm gonna live it here, you know? I really don't even know what's happening right now. It's almost my turn. I kinda wanna get a breakfast sandwich. Would that be good? That'd be fire. Maybe I'll get a breakfast sandwich too. It'll be a little mukbang moment. <laughs> oh, I think they have Beyond Breakfast meat here now. Maybe I'll try that little fun little taste test. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna do that for sure. Hi there, welcome to Starbucks. Where can I get started for you? Hi, can I get a grande vanilla sweet cream cold brew? with a nitro mm -hmm. lid. And then can I also get the Beyond Meat Cheddar and Egg Sandwich? Yeah, is there anything else for you today? No, that's all, please. It's 11.53, you can drive it now. Thank you. <laughs> this just got so much more exciting. Holy fuck. Oh good, it does come with cheese. I was like, some Beyond Meat things don't come with cheese because, hello, vegan? Oh wait, there's also egg on it. That wasn't, that wasn't bright. I have no explanation for that. Anyways. As I was saying, you know like if you get a Beyond Burger somewhere, they don't come with cheese because it's trying to be vegan, or it is vegan? I am not vegan, so I get the cheese. So I just wanted to make sure there was cheese on the sandwich, but there's also fucking eggs, so obviously it's not made to be vegan. Oh look, here's my current wildflower case I have on here. I got crazy jackals. Yay! Is it illegal to go on your phone in a drive-thru? 
For legal reasons, I'm not in a drive-thru. I'm just parked in a parking lot. This is just a random clip. Hi. Thank you. you. Good. How are you? Did it work? There you go. Yeah. You have a nice day. Thank you. You too. I hate when my card fucks up. The tap didn't work and it just gave me all the fucking um, anxiety in the world because I was like, bitch, I swear I have money. Do not, don't, don't think that of me. I promise. Not that there's anything wrong with that. If you're running low on funds and you get declined, fuck it, who cares? Well, like you might care, I guess, but like, I don't care. Everyone gets that feeling. You know when you like go to use a debit machine and the debit machine fucks up and you know damn well it's the debit machine, but you have to make sure that the all, the cashier or the checkout person or whatever also knows it's the debit machine. And you're like, bitch, I have money, don't worry. Um, me too. But yeah, worst nightmare, hate that. Okay, we're at my favorite parking spot for these types of videos, so let's go. Now, oh my God, this kind of turned into like a taste test and an unboxing, holy fuck. First and foremost, let's take a sip of coffee because I'm not fucking alive yet. Um, I just um, panicked and ordered a sweet cream vanilla cold brew, a vanilla sweet cream cold brew, whatever the fuck. And it's delicious, and I know it's delicious, so let's deal with it. <sighs> Fire. I'm really excited for this. Let's try a bite of this. This is the Beyond Meat Starbucks breakfast sandwich. Let's take a little peek. Oh my god, it looks fire. Looks like the burgers, actually. Oh wow. Shut the fuck up. Beyond Meat slaps so fucking hard, I literally don't care what anyone says. This shit is, ah! They have good fucking egg too. Oh my God, am I spitting at you? Sorry. Mm. Like, you know McDonald's breakfast sandwiches? Hate the egg on that. But this egg, high key fire. This is so good. It tastes like Italian sausage. Are you dumb? Wait, what the fuck? I know like all Beyond Meat is like the same brand or whatever I think. This one is just, hits way harder. And the, whatever bun they use, is so good. Okay, I'm gonna finish this and then with the unboxing. BRB bitch. Actually, I decided against that because, like, mukbang vibes. Beyond Meat fucking slops. Period. Some people are hardcore not fans. Me, low-key prefer it over regular meat because it's just more flavorful. I feel like they overcompensate it. Obviously, they kind of have to because it's not actually meat and they're trying to mimic meat, but they put so much seasonings in it. It's just so good. But I just deserve it. Sorry if I'm talking about my mouth open. No one's around, just you. It's hit so hard. Holy fuck. Mm. Did not get any napkins, though, so boom. Look in here. Always keep toilet paper in your car, people. Actually, I think my friend put this in here because I never have toilet paper in my car, so fake fucking news. All fucking dusty now. That's why I don't do that. Okay, phone case time, bitch. You know what we doing today? We unboxing the Wildflower Mirror Case. <laughs> Let's rip this bitch open. I got the Wildflower Mirror Case when I first saw this launch. Literally, probably like not a lot, but like six of you tagged me in the post and were like, "Bitch, you getting it?" And I was like, "Bitch, I already ordered it." You know what I'm saying? But like, literally, thank you for tagging me because I did not know this was dropping. If you tag me, you're real one. Not opening the paper out of here because I don't give a fuck. Um, let's just get right on into the case because I'm fucking excited. Okay, so we got two stickers. You want to check out? I'm going to go stick this on my friend Cass's fucking face because she literally breathes leopard. Are you ready? Look at this. Can you see yourself? I literally, it's kind of weird showing a mirror case because like I can't really show you the case. You just see everything in the reflection. Like look at my setup here. Wow. Impeccable. Incredible. Get a feel of this ASMR vibe. Best part of lure finish feels premium. Just feels premium. Okay, here's the case. You get this thing in the little case, obviously. Pause and read. Pause and read. Bye. And now here's the case. My first thing I wanted to look at was the inside because the inside, if you've ever had a wildfire case, you know that they're like um, some type of material. But this one is just plain white plastic. Can you tell? But here's the case. Ooh, what a mirror. Oh my goodness. Let me look at myself. I do be looking a little warped. Oh, but if you hold it really close, it's fine. Maybe it's meant to be a close-up mirror. Because when it's far away, I look like a fucking clown. <laughs> that vibe? But anyway, let's put it on my phone. The only other mirror case I've ever had is a case to find mirror case. And I fucking love that case, but it did age kind of bad. Not gonna lie. Like it got really scratched and ugly, but this is a wildflower one. Oh, she's slick as a fly. And there's already 600 million fingerprints on it. It does feel like a little, not as sturdy as another mirror case I have, but that's okay, we love you, Wildflower. Maybe one day I'll do a comparison between the two mirror cases that I have, but it's already quite fingerprinty. But you know what? Look at it looks fucking slick, okay? You can't fucking go wrong. You know, it looks so slick, I just love a good mirror case. Ugh. Wow, wow. It's so interesting to see a Wildflower case without the material on the inside too. Like, just look at this bit. I'm literally, I wanna show you the case, but like you're literally just looking in the mirror. Like, that's you. That's fucking, who is that? That is you. Here's a little Wildflower gem. Hello, bitch. Yeah. Can you see yourself in it? 
Okay, there's the case, guys. What do you guys think? It does look slightly warped when it's far away, but when it's close up, which might be the purpose of this whole mirror case, it works incredible. Very nice. It is slightly flimsy, not gonna lie. The back, like you can feel it pressing in and out, like when you do that. But I think most plastic cases do that. But overall, I'll give it like a 7 out of 10 on the mirror case scenario. You know what I'm saying? It does look fucking slick though. I love this shit. Wow. Ow. Okay, that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed this video. A little vlog, a little unboxing, a little mukbang. Wow. We love a multi-talented Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, type of video, give it a thumbs up. I've been trying to do like different phone case unboxings when I do them. One time I did a mukbang. I guess again, I did a mukbang and a little vlog thing. Just cause sometimes I feel like me sitting here for seven minutes unboxing a case gets fucking hella boring. So I want to switch it up, but we love unboxings here. So we're going to keep it up. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. As I said, you can follow all my social media in the description below, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, all that shit. Subscribe, turn on your notifications. You know the fucking drill. And thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next fucking video. Cheers. Fuck that guy.